Namaste. Hello, my dear beautiful viewers. How are you all doing today? I welcome you all to your channel. This is your host Shivangsh and I don't know why the hell I'm shining so much all over again. All of a sudden. All right. So, my dear beautiful viewers, my dear beautiful viewers, what message you need to know today? Yes, father. Yes, father. Some of you may be dealing with somebody with the alphabet F. U as an umbrella, C as an, oh not C, it's E, E as an elephant, D as in David, S as in Sam, Y as in Yankee, R as in Ram, C as in Charlie, or X. This alphabet may uh, be uh, related to you in some way, shape or form, okay? F, U, E, G, S, Y, C and X. X. X factor all right oh okay okay true devotion and faith true devotion and faith Krishna is saying my dear beautiful child I'm really very happy with the devotion and the faith that you have shown towards me a humble offering to God is greater than any material material wealth I feel like this group of people that I'm connecting to yeah, you got really fucked up by your life experiences so much that you have completely shifted your focus from the 3D world to the material from the materialistic world. All right, name, fame, money, this and that to completely it's, it's like a 360 degree. Yeah, you have gone through a 360 degree experience of where you truly came to this understanding that you know what God is all in all. You know, it's all about my devotion and it's this messages will only be for those those who are actually doing that living a holistic life where you are showing your complete dedication and devotion and faith to 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 your god all right that's the card that we got from krishna consciousness true devotion and faith a humble offering to god is greater than any materialistic world wealth all right so some of you are probably completely you know i am happy with whatever i have my god I really appreciate that thank you so very much showing your humbleness gratitude grace and you are just uh, focusing in your life these are those group of people all right absolutely uh, you have a lot of thoughts going on at the back you know about a lot of ifs and buts but in the divine timing everything will be uh, revealed to you but for now what you need to know is uh, for whoever you tune in you see this is entirely you know so much of brightness is there in this photograph which is the thinking man all right and that the card number is four six which is ten all right thinking man somebody is thinking heavily heavily about you somebody is really thinking heavily about you oh <laughs> Okay, probably somebody is trying to make a choice which way to go, which one to choose, what exactly I need to do. A thinking man is thinking about making a choice. This is the lover card. All right. Yeah. For you, you have absolutely surrendered this to the universe. This connection is already been taken, shared by the universe. Your love is with the father in heaven right now. <laughs> all right that's why that's why probably you're feeling very much disconnected to the group of people that i'm connecting right now you are like this probably you don't even realize that you are going to their here and they're probably donating this and that you know knowingly or unknowingly you know talking to everybody nicely you're being humble you know automatically it's happening with you i'm feeling like that okay because you are vibing in that energy of devotion and faith so when a person is vibing in that energy of devotion and faith this person is like this only go to everybody chill out smile happy you know everybody loves to see you ha uh, see you there talk to you you know you get every support and help all right uh, probably you can go to a couple of the shops where you can get uh, things uh, free all right these are the things that really happen you know you can get stuff in credit all right because people see that you are a good while you have completely shifted your focus, I'm, I'm, I'm really feeling this, that this group of people are connected, all right? Because in spirit, they are connected, all right? In spirit, they are connected. Why I'm saying this? Because of the lover's card. In spirit, they are connected, but in 3D, no way. In 3D, probably some of you, uh, you know, all of a sudden probably realize, damn, you know, I did not think about my DM. 
<laughs> yeah, I mean, I did not think about my DM. Absolutely. You are this thinking man's wish fulfillment. That's why you are here, not the third party who will come as a choice where they will have to make a choice. I don't see that. This person is uh, thinking about taking that control back of their life. All right. So that they can have that wish fulfillment or two major arcanas, my dear. You see three major arcanas and I'm telling you it is taking place. This emperor, this thinking man is the same, all right? These two are the same. This thinking man is thinking about coming in their power, all right? After the tower, okay? Come in your power, be that true emperor, not vibing in that ego energy or showing your grudges and attitude for no FF good reason, beep, beep, good reason, you know? It's, I mean, what I'm feeling, you know, with this card, an emperor and thinking man, nine of cups and true devotion. Universe is saying, my child, let me tell you, my child. And you see, for the first time I notice it, it's looking like eight. Do you see that? Isn't that looking like eight? You see, this is like kind of soul connection. You see, you guys are meant to be. When it is meant to be, I mean, there is no point of you wasting your time in thinking. It's all more about like, damn, come out of your thinking mode and take an action. All right. Because when something is written on stars, there's no point about weighing the pros and cons. All right. No way. You see, and come on, this cannot be coincident. You see, are you seeing this? Lovers again, pentacle, nine of cups, queen of cups, hermit moving on and my father showed up finally with that and truth your father is going to bring truth towards you about this connection okay very soon and this person they wish it or they don't wish it they want it or they don't want it but universe will brought them to uh, will bring them to in a situation where you need to get ready my dear to commit to speak your truth about what you truly truly feel and want from this queen all right what this queen can give you okay and you need to if you want to make a move in life need to really really tap into your spirit and make that choice all right so he has wasted enough time. This queen, king has wasted enough time in making a decision. Always in that thinking mode, thinking mode, thinking mode. And hence, you guys have not been able to complete a cycle. Hence, you are feeling like your life is completely changed into like 360 degree overnight. All right. You're feeling like that. Okay. Like my life is completely, completely effed up. All right. 360 degree I have no control I really don't you know it's more like this not even clouded it's just more like you know what if the clarity that I have I am really not sure if I should be walking on that path I'm not sure if it is going to lead me to wish fulfillment because why you are feeling like that because of this connection you are not able to close the cycle because of the intensity of the connection hence you are not able to move uh, so at the end of the day the crux of this download is that you are brought by the universe affirmation it just fell down brought by the universe to get into that hermit mode and when you get into that hermit mode then only you know when you sit for meditation or get into that hermit mode that's when you feel like yeah something is moving even in energetic level also you start to feel like something is moving how you will know that something is moving you will you will have a proper sleep you will get up on time you will be like doing your household work you will feel like you are engaging all right you are engaging and you see one two three four five six six major arcana surrounded by this queen no joke trust me no joke it is happening like this all right so your father in heaven lord shivai comes in shows up as a fork in the road my dear, which way you want to go, no matter, 
I love you father I love you baba so much it's like this my child where do you want to go you go this side you go that side you see you know no matter which way you go you know at the end you are going to meet the person that you have uh, had a connection with with whom you either even if it is a soulmate having connection it's a karmic close the cycle so that that is written on stars you can head towards how much time you need need to make that choice how much of time you really want to waste in thinking all right so emperor is all about like you know come in your power take that action all right uh, enough of staying in that uh, hermit mode thinking mode all right you need to close the cycle i'm feeling like this person is getting nudged by the universe right now to close the cycle because their life is in total mess all right and hence universe is making them see what is good for them all right and when they see what is good for them they actually see this you as their wish fulfillment that's why why i'm saying you how i'm sure about you because you are the one who is watching this reading not a third party or a karmic all right so you know okay you know who you are you know what is your wish fulfillment you know what you deserve and you know what the truth is it is just that with the external experiences you are not able to tap in properly to your intuition but they are tapped in you know they are tapped in into the intuition you see cup energies are there their intuition is shouting out to them all right their really intuition is uh, is really shouting out to them because of this uh, soulful connection all right their soul is uh, now i'm feeling like yeah their their soul is shouting out to them can you let me be free please hello mind can you let me be free please can you can you it's like this now when the soul, soul shouts will you free me please i don't want to stay here why don't you understand they will have that talk their soul will talk to them they will not even understand from where these thoughts these are random thoughts that's how soul talks then they will get hurt here and there all right because you know that's how universe works that's how universe teaches so father present out here is like helping them see what they are trying to destroy and they cannot destroy when the biggest destroyer is here so universe is trying to destroy their procrastination procrastinating behavior all right not too much devoted too much associated with materialistic world all right too much of this materialistic belief system they are caught up in this materialistic belief system hence god is shifting them with the towers towards devotion towards faith towards coming in the power towards seeing the bigger picture having the higher knowledge and wisdom listening to their reasoning and logical brain all right and to understand what this connection is all about and you see this is no joke i mean how can universe let this fall apart two different deck showing the same energy lovers you know this two kids these are lord shiva's kid all right i'm telling you this is your inner child one is the divine masculine and one is the divine feminine all right so this is the lord shiva's uh, child all right so lord shiva will not let uh, let them play or let you also play with that child which is the soul soul right the source energy so lord god will not let you do that so what he will do he will bring tower clear the debris all right and keep you stay with with what is needed for you so let's say for an example i saw 14 15 let's say for an example you are strongly feeling this connection all right in your bones you are not able to make that move or close that cycle and you have no clue damn whatsoever what is holding you in this connection always know this my dear beautiful viewers your father in heaven will not let you keep stuck with something that is not serving you any purpose that's why i also say and we we spiritual world i mean like we say that my dear you know if something is like for an example if you are getting some soul food from my channel which is helping you grow then stay 
right? But if nothing is giving you like a soul food and you are wasting your time, why wasting your time? Go! Are you getting me what I'm saying? So God will not let you stay there where you are not understanding anything or not getting anything, all right? So God, so if this connection, this person is helping you grow, evolve and helping you be a better version of yourself, then stay. Then stay, show your uh, conviction into this connection. But no, this person is draining your energy. You feel like to kill this and that, what is going on, all right? And you cannot find a footing of yourself then you should know time to go be it farewell are you getting me that's when we come and bring these messages for you so you you are the better judge of your energy right how you are feeling with this person is this person helping you grow is this person's triggering helping you see a better version of yourself every day every day every day and you are turning out to be something all right if yes stay take those hit take those triggering and you will see the outcome you will be shocked it will be beautiful surprise for you trust me you'll feel be blissful full of abundance all right but no if this person is is rather this person has made you something like you used to be really good before now you have become evil like all right or you get tend to get angry this and that is happening in your life then the time has finally come i'm sorry my dear this is not something i want i wanted something really soulful but i don't see that walk away if they are meant for you they will be polished by the universe and will come back if not you will just know you'll automatically not feel that all right that's how universe works to close any karmic cycle all right and what i'm feeling is that in your connection there was a third party yes and they wasted a lot of time in making a choice and that's when a tower happened like what is it that you need to make a choice don't you have your vivek your wisdom your higher knowledge uh, to understand what is right and what is wrong? Who is in Dharma side and who is in Adharma side? Who is doing what? Can't you see that? You know, it's more like this universe question to this person. Can't you see that? How much time you continue to think? How much time you want to stay stuck, not speaking your truth, holding on to your emotions? You know, this person is not letting his soul to even breathe, you know, feel, you know, See, if you give soul food, say let for, let's say for an example, for your DM, you are the soul food. They feel happy with you. They feel blissful with you. They love to spend time with you. But with their ego mind, they are not letting themselves to come towards you. Their ego, right? But soul is nudging them. Damn, I want to go to her. Why the hell are you are keeping me here? Are you getting me? That's power. Which is of a lot of power all right i'm feeling like that this man is like i don't know how he handled towers man i really don't know i really don't know how he handles tower feeling sorry for this man to be honest you know really feeling sorry for this man how he handles tower either this person is very very adamant you know i will not if this person is like this you know your dm much better than me <coughs> affirmation if they are in this uh, energy or vibes in this energy a manipulator egotistic i am all in all i have done no wrong if their attitudes are like this like the way i am talking all right if they are doing like all this trust me i'm telling you my dear beautiful viewers this person's ego will be shattered in a way that they will be like yeah i mean i'm lacking board you see i'm really lacking board it's more like about it's more like this this connection is not about choice anymore all right 
this connection is not about choice anymore but this person is wasting his time in just choosing this and that this and that this and that and like this is going on in in their head they will understand certain things in a very rude way in a very rude way <laughs> see no joke I just randomly pulled a card and it's saying eternal love my Archangel Michael it says help me perceive all of the love that surrounds me so that I can feel safe receiving expressing and giving love validation I told you they are making you wait on a decision comparing trying to make a choice when this is written on stars eternal love with the lovers twice this is not about any choice this is written on stars eternal love how can you waste damn your time in weighing pros and cons who is right with whom I should go I mean can't you see what karmic looks like and can't you see how divine looks like feeling like that and then tower all right then tower okay but as promised to you you continue to do you keep sending them positive energies pray to universe God please give them higher knowledge and wisdom help them with your uh, you know with your energy so that they can see the truth truth of all truth nothing but the truth yeah when you do that your father in heaven is taking care of everything all right they will make sure that you know their intuition speaks to them even louder than before all right when you continue to do that they will continue to come in their power this person really needs to i feel like god has brought them into a place where then they will be like they will be like this like kind of you know uh, this person probably had so much of ego that they thought like i will do everything myself and i'll show you then your father came in between all right like a fork with his threshold on the road show me please show me how you do that that's when they realize that damn i really have no power all right those kind of awakening really you know takes the peace of your mind you know and it can take you for a ride for a long time all right long time so you can see since how long you guys are in separation this person is going through all those kind of energies you don't go by what you are seeing in the 3d world or what is happening in the 3d world you have nothing to do with that trust me what you feel in energy is something that will speak to you in volume all right that will speak to you in volume my dear okay so i'm telling you my dear beautiful viewers that forgive this person for whatever they have done or if you are feeling stuck or i right, waiting is killing you all you need to do is try to find a way out that makes you happy and you continue to do you while god is really taking care of them their ego this man ego their man ego will be shattered all right their man ego will be shattered and you will feel tower too all right because you also have divine masculine within you i am channeling the energy of the divine masculine so divine masculine within you will also get triggered all right so in your in your space uh, you know god is trying to refine the divine masculine energy and bring you up up in in your confidence in your aura everything all right so that you can finally learn to balance the feminine and masculine qualities and for them who have killed the divine feminine energy within them god will force them to come crashing down in the divine masculine energy so the divine feminine can come up once they go up they will follow automatically you know that's how they will stand up and they will also come in that alignment within them of the divine masculine and feminine right now divine masculine energy is overpowering them hence they are not able to uh, understand or see exactly like 
because they are seeing things from a um, from a 3d perspective they are not getting going to see things from the spiritual perspective for which they truly need to get towers after towers so that they break down and ultimately they should not have any other option than falling in front of the god this person had that much of an ego that probably uh, stopped going to uh, following God or stopped going to church or you know they were not doing anything like that. They were too much into partying, boozing, girls, this and that. Too, too much of all this. And eternal love was all out in vain. That's something God will not let go by like that. All right. No, not at all. So you continue to show your devotion and faith in whatever you are doing, my dear beautiful viewers, all right? While God is taking care for the rest for you. Yes. King of Swords, they will come. We got this sword energy as well, right? Ace of Swords. So King of Swords, you are genuine. You know, when they will be put into their knees by the divine, you know, to see, you know, because as I told you again, I mean, it's not about choice it's all about now time to take an action to speak your truth and go and march towards what is your soul calling what makes you happy all right if you don't buy in positive energy you are contaminating rest of the energy so god will not let that happen at any cost no way all right and somebody out of their ego they cannot shiver a tie like a soulful connection like this right they cannot okay so balance is coming they are also tired and worn out obviously they will they will come uh, get that energy for sure all right but believe that universe has your back and universe is working behind the scene all right for this connection so f u c d s y x however it re resonates for you this alphabet okay so i hope my dear beautiful viewers this messages has helped you in some way shape or form until we meet again i am sending across much love and light to you all om namah shivaya stay blessed and in peace bye bye